Okay, we're out here this afternoon on our technical water, and as you can see, this is a great technical water pond. We've got a lot of points, a lot of levees, a lot of re-entries. We're running Hank here this afternoon. Now, Hank just earned his master title, and we're working at improving his technical proficiency. We're doing a double water blind, and for the sake of time, we didn't record the first one, but it's a little short, about an 80-yard blind here with a long entry into the water. It's got a runway down the middle, a trap he could fall into. Hank just did a really nice job on that, did it in about two whistles. But the real purpose of that blind was to set up the right hand blind. Now, this right hand blind involves going across the first pond, which is lunging water, coming out on the levee at an angle. Now, the levee goes in a direction to throw the dog to the right, but the dog that does the right thing is going to get back in the water and exit almost in the corner of the back of that cove run about 20 yards across the land and pick up the bird. Gonna be a lot of suction to the left where he's just ran this short blind. So let's see how he does on it. Oops, sorry, buddy. Good boy. Come here, Hank. Sit. Sit, we got a dead bird. You can see he's looking back at the one he just did. No, here, sit, dead, dead, sit. Dead bird, good, good. Watch that, watch that. Bye. Nice angle, a little too fast. Right. Gave me a really nice 45 there. Now let's see what he does when he gets out. Right. You can see when he exited, he thought about walking down the levee. We gave him one cast, put him back in the water. Now we're going to slide him down the shore. Right. Good job, all right. Now he went wet, we're gonna make him come back wet. Good. And you can see he came back in exactly where he exited. We didn't want him to square the bank. He took a nice angle out, drove back across the land, a couple more whistles and we picked it up. Really good job. Now Hank's not doing it perfect yet, obviously. Ideally, when he exited the lunging water pond, he'd have driven across the levee and hit the water without that one cast in, but Definitely making improvements and not fighting us at all. This is the kind of thing we're looking for. We don't expect perfection when we start doing this technical stuff. We just want the dog to work with us along the way. And that's a real good job. Come on, buddy.